we rode 20 calories for 10 sets with 90 seconds rest in between. That's absolutely kicked the hell out of me. Average about 41, 42, I think. Ah! All right, so I've just done a little workout, but we're really confused over some of this. So, uh, I'll just show you. So, we did. Um, we rode 20 calories for 10 sets, with 90 seconds rest in between. So, as you go into the memory, you can see your intervals. First by the there yeah right so this is mine here all right so for each 20 calories i would have doing about 45 43 some down at 41 some at seconds for each time yeah uh, averaging about 15 1600 calories an hour which stroke rate 34 and about 220 meters each time yeah but the rodders he were uh, going a lot faster Find it like 36, 35 seconds, all right? But even though he's only rowing 20 calories, he's only he's only pulling 200 meters for each time. It's averaging about 130 there, under 128, yeah? So what I don't understand is, I'm, run, I'm rowing about 220, 220 meters, yeah? And he's rowing about 200 meters. So, for example, say we had to row 220 meters, yeah? It'd take, obviously me, a little bit longer there, but it'd take, even though we're both rowing 20 calories, it takes me 20 meters more to row than 20 calories, if you know what I'm trying to say, yeah? All right, whereas with rodders, for him to row 220 meters, he'd have to stay on for a bit longer. So what I'm trying to say is, what I really don't understand, uh, and hope someone can help us, is for that power that he's giving into the rower, to row them 20 calories, why aren't it transferring to meters as much? Do you know what I'm trying to say? So what we're saying is, say, we had to row 220 meters. Rodders, even though he would row 220 meters, it'd probably take him about 21, 22 calories, whereas I could do it just in 20 calories. Do you know what I'm trying to say? So um, it's just a bit confusing, and uh, if anybody knows out about it, then uh, drop us a comment below, get in touch. All right.